my family being in Slovenia, I think it will be only in visits. <laughs> yeah. I don't think they would be ready for that yet. The West family type and the European family type is a little bit more different and complicated. I mean, like, my brother here, I mean, we only see probably once a week if he calls me to take him somewhere, that's basically it. I mean, he has his life, I have my, my life, we just deal with our things separately. Well, it's Otar Oliver Campbell the first. Yeah, I'm from the west side of Jamaica, that's Westmoreland. I came to Slovenia in 2003, 14th of July, I started working on the 15th. One thing, well, I can say as a Jamaican, you know, if you grew up in Jamaica, it's a, you see things that are not here. You know, every block has a gang. Whether you're in the gang or not, you're a part of it. I mean, there's a lot of violence that you see on a day-to-day -day basis. So, in Slovenia, when a guy comes to see him, probably want to fight, you don't think too much because he's only going to beat you up and send you to the hospital. Back home, when a guy comes to beat you up, you're going to the morgue. So it's a different thing. I try to avoid fights as best as possible. The first guy I had a fight with, I tell him, please, three times, I'm Jamaican, I don't have time for this. And he just came at me and I just let him have it, you know? It is what it is. Was he Slovene? Yeah, he was. He, he was just a guy that thinks because I'm black, he can just put me on the floor, but it didn't work out like that. Slovenia is actually not a dangerous place. I mean, it's just young kids like want to be tough guys, but it's not really dangerous. Yeah. What's the thing that you're most proud of? Me. I think since uh, the last six years since I've been here, I'm more, I would say more mentally stronger than I was before. But sometimes it can, it can break, but I'm still trying to keep it together. You know, it's a different culture. You have to deal with a lot of things. And if you're not mentally rounded, then you could break down just like that. I mean, if you look at me now, a Jamaican driving taxi in Slovenia, you know, you have to have the balls to do that. You know, for me, I look on life, you know, you see every step you take, it doesn't matter the decision you make, whether it's negative or positive. It's actually a building process. It is, it's either it makes you or breaks you. It doesn't matter what the decision may be. And these are the things you have to live with, you have to learn from.